Hello, welcome to this video cast of subscribers to Callum Chew. Um, yeah, just to follow up because it's an interesting time, uh, as you know, in the paranormal world, let's say. And, you know, read, look more into it. Dan Duffy's just done a video where he's demonstrating how you can fake stuff. Um, but, uh, I think it's what's needed. I've, I've been saying for some time, well, more to myself, having these ideas, I'll say, that the entertainment videos, let's demonstrate, let's show people, you know, the, this is the entertainment videos for people that like the entertainment side. And this is how we do it, behind the scenes. And obviously being a conspiracy researcher, behind the scenes, I love all behind the scenes. Uh, so, yeah, and, you know, I, I do believe in having an understanding, well, whispers in the body, you know, my biggest passion. I, I, do, I follow David Ive, for Christ's sake, that we're all one consciousness having different experiences. We are spirits in the body, but most par paranormal activity is suckle. And it's like sometimes I feel my dad's energy, it's more of a, a presence. I get a lot of stuff in dreams. Um, in, in people really want it explained properly. Uh, David Icke on Iconic.com, he did a series, his 13 part series last year, called The Nature of Reality, and he goes into how it all works. Um, on what's being hidden. Oh, battery's low. Now, is it... Rip on charge. Now, is it possible... Um... If I'll put it on charge, because... I can't best concentrate. God, they zoom them down, these batteries, don't they? Crikey, O'Reilly. Anyway. <laughs> it's alright. I'm not... I'm not charging... Charging port. That's what I'm all American for. Excuse me, but that's good now, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's gone. But but yeah, um, now I was explaining in the last video most what we call. Polygast activity, which is German for noisy ghost, Polton meaning noisy and Geist meaning ghost. Oddly enough, uh, in ninety nine percent of cases, it, teenage girl, you take a teenage girl out of there, out of the room, and the activity ceases. Now, David Icke explains in his Nature Reality series, and also David Alt, a genuine psychic medium, a phenomenal one. There's a lot of scammers out there as well. With that, um. Is, is is that no? David says it could be mischievous spirits, but most of them they're not. We are capable of a lot more stuff. Uh, it's like spon it's a bit it's spontaneous telekinesis, um, but in most cases, it's teenage girls, not all. But most things you see can spirits say, Well, we're in a VMF, yeah. People have got genuine stuff. I do believe people have got genuine EVPs. I do believe people have got genuine spirit boxes. Just put it out there. I, I do. I understand now. This is the point what really upsets me. The ultimate scam that is played on humanity is convincing people that we're just a body. This world is all there is. Science. We're a cosmic accident. Life's a bitch, and then you die. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I don't know my anxiety and depression. And then this, like I explained in the other bit, yeah, one before the other video. Um, is that you've got to believe this judgmental God or when you pass away, you're a sinner and you've got to believe this vicar's man or woman in a frock and what God wants. Which again, don't, don't really uh, help, help, uh, help people. So, you know, the point is people scamming, there's fake mediums out there and I do believe in mediumship. I went to Atticus Spiritual Church, Bold Street, Sheffield, I was saying that and there was a medium there who could communicate with animals and because everything's consciousness. And I got a genuine message. There was no cold reading. Because the stuff that she was coming out with, I've never met her, she's never met me. And 
it wasn't cold reading, it was proper stuff that was going through. Accurate. I've also been to the Spiritualist Church and witnessed, not saying a bad mediumship, but a very poor mediumship from a different lady. And I've also, um, but the people what scam um, and fake paranormal activity or mediumship, well, what are you doing? Because the ultimate way out of this nonsense and simulation is to not acquiesce, is to understand the world that is ever, all that is ever was ever can be. But if people are faking stuff, that's no good. So I'm glad Dan Duff has come forward. Um, and I think deep down we all want to believe. But I don't really believe. I'm not going to sound big-headed, big hard. I know I, what I'm saying is they hide this knowledge. That's how it comes to my conclusions. I'm not going to be able to believe that or do that. But, yeah, uh, Fisher might be saying all one. And if you think, Dan Duffy is right on this. Uh, if you're getting paranormal activity extreme in a video, chances are they're going to be fake. But I don't understand it. It's like, I don't get what they get, get from it. If you've been entertained, like just doing the entertainment side, fair enough. But if you're deliberately faking, you know, and he does explain it, it's a dark arts paranormal. And exploring fighters and proving demons. I know you had that thing all in world in it, and then uh, that thing, bone, bone in the wall, bone game. Remember all that? Twenty eighteen. We fell out with Mark Smith. But they are genuine investigators. Now, he danned up for saying that his lot other video that he's seen mocks up for it, fake few videos. I'm not sure because he doesn't get extreme paranormal activity every time. I think one about even people maybe mocks is maybe interpreting, but. You know, I do believe Mox is to be genuine. It works for Amy from Shadow Hunters, and she don't like fake souls, so she won't work with him, in my view. And Night Up, they do seem to be genuine. Uh, Ghost on Trent, you mentioned them. Uh, Ouija Brothers, DNA Paranormal, when, when they do it, and I've had a lot on. Um, with Lexi's dad being involved in a car crash, but hopefully, the way he's on the member, bless him. Uh, John Six Sense is gen very genuine in Jojo, and Mark Smith's actually back, and he's genuine. Um, then that's what obsessed him a lot of faking got it, not the only thing that got to him, but keep it paranormal, as we were. What we call paranormal, as David Icke explains, it's actually normal or more normal, there's nothing parrot about it. But when people are faking, it just makes me and David Icke's messages look silly, and then people aren't going to. People are just going to carry on acquiescing with the system within a world order within humans. That's the point I'm coming from it. But, um, yeah, I think it's about time, you know, yeah, Dark Arts does seem to have the paranormal uh, stuff go off a lot. Exploring fighters, yeah, I don't know if he's fake or not. Got, but Dan Duffy's working with Proven Demons, or you saw one instant. But like tricks that change with EVP and I demonstrate scratching on carpet. That does happen. Sadly, that does happen. Uh, you can misinterpret it for a voice. The one, I, oh, I could even scratch it because I was expecting that. But people have caught genuine stuff as well. I mean, when Moss Smith did work with Andrew, Andrew were not alleged to be genuine. There was, so we know everybody was still. And they asked the monk, are you at 30th Drive in 2017? Are you happy? Or 13th September 2017. See if it's not there. I'll try not to have it. And he said, are you happy or angry? And he said, angry. And that were a class A. And nobody would move. I remember it. And nobody would. It, and they put the EVP recorder, I think, on the floor, on the settee, if I remember rightly. But uh, sometimes I hold it, but I try and hold it still. But things are right about Bending down and, you know, but on here, like when I've done it, I'll put it on, say, I am thinking about, I'm going to be doing one soon. Uh, the batch is too, too low. Um, so, yeah, I thought I'd just think, because do a video. Um, the way people use gadgets and, because we live in an electric universe, spirit, way more for me, 
I mean, spirits can and do communicate. You can be stood there hours. You might get some activity. You usually can feel, feel static or electric. I have one of the spiritual church. You can feel a static energy. I'm sat here, and sometimes I'll feel my dad will get spiders on my face. And most of the time, it's loved ones and positivity, and it's, you know, inspiration. But also, obviously, demon, well, I, I, I said there, oh, well, go for the demon. Demons are behind the main energy, they can take form. Super time cleaning grades off going to this, going through the last video of that royal family, and that's how they create the simulation. So there's, there's light and dark, but people faking stuff. It's like I do believe in possession, I think a lot of these global cult, like the royal family and things, under possession, and you can be thrashing around, but you know. It, People faking stuff just doesn't, it's not helping. I don't know what you're hoping to achieve. Because you're taking my freedom, your freedom, and everybody else's. If you want to do it, do a proper legit investigation. So, that that's really what I wanted to say. Uh, so, yeah. It is about time. I'm, it's good. It's, uh, also, I'm not, I'm not a skeptic. I'm a believer. Like I don't, I don't really know. It's, it's, it's a lot to it. You know the idea that we're just about. I mean, that some magic spectrum is no point, no, not five percent. We have a factor of that. The rest of infinity, and these like lower astral with the demons and uh, these fourth of these other dimensions, but it's just off our frequency band. And when you get a symbolic of a radio station on the analog system, you have got the dominant one. You get interference with what we call paranormal activity or ghosts and spirits and demons. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, I, I think this bit, by exposing it, really, it's pushed back and we'll only get the genuine stuff. And that's what we want, but we do want the genuine stuff. Uh, I now understand a bit more where Dan Duff is coming from. Uh, just wasn't sure before. Obviously, I've, we all know I've got a spot, soft spot for Andrew Duffy. But I don't know what he's doing at the minute. I think he's just checked out, as you say. That is not paranormal, if you can hear it. It's just something coming in the building. Yeah, it's just people coming back from work, guys. As it's tea time here in Britain, England. Um, but that's it. I'll see you all later. Take care. Keep it real.